comes from the legs, the leg drive. Talk about his results at Wimbledon in the French, and I think if you serve as well as Shelton does, you should be relevant in any tournament. And I think that might just. The first, he's got all the shots. You never quite know when he's going to use them. Body's dead. Game seven. He's struggling to get into the point, but you have to. You have to maintain enthusiasm and keep your imagination, keep trying to think it through. in tennis are narrow, Six aren't they? You know, Connell works so hard, but... And if you've got Shelton serve in his game, why not? Yeah, well played. The reason for that conversation is your comment about... That was, that was a nice first volley. That was... Covers line. And Chris goes line. He's got to then volley back in front of Chris. Here you just have an open court. Anything... the break. Shelton now really starting to move into his work. Just kept it going. Full set point. Again, second set. Pressing set for... Probably the cleanest return he's hit off that backhand wing. And this will feel good. Hitting a winner. Change a losing game. There's no guarantee it'll work. But it's very hard against Ben when, when you, your contact point is that deep off return.
Moses. O'Connell breaks and leads 4-3. Extends and Connell serving to stay alive. Almost falling away as he hit that one. Every reason to be involved. He was out of the contest. It was a couple of loose points here and there from... Young Shelton didn't have it all his own way, but he found a way, and he goes through to the third round. Well, he had to show some fight. There's a lot to like. Sense of relief, but look, hats off to Chris O'Connell because he was not in the contest after the first two sets, but he found a way.